Vladimir Putin ordered his Pacific Fleet to undertake surprise war games to test their readiness to stage a retaliatory nuclear strike on the West. The Pacific Fleet's strategic firepower has been seen since Soviet times as Moscow's main weapon in retaliatory strikes. This move appears to be a deliberate show of strength against the West amid Putin's war against Ukraine, which has already cost hundreds of thousands of lives. The exercise is based around a naval base in Vladivostok. We're expected to involve the firing of missiles and testing the readiness of nuclear-capable strategic bombers as well as the fleet's submarines. These war games also had more limited objectives, such as repelling supposed enemy attacks on the Sakhalin Island and the Kuril chain north of Japan. Japan asserts to territory rights to the Kuril Islands, which were grabbed by Stalin in World War II. Russia last year suspended peace talks with Japan to protest Tokyo's sanctions against Moscow over its action in Ukraine. General Valery Karazmov, Kremlin's most senior soldier, said Russia's naval forces would be put on high alert during the drills and deployed to training areas where they will conduct combat exercises. He said the main goal of the check is to build up the ability of the armed forces to solve the task of repelling the aggression of a potential enemy from oceanic and sea areas. During the event, the Pacific Fleet will have to repel massive missile and airstrikes, conduct exercises to search for and destroy submarines, and perform torpedo and artillery firing and missile launches. Keep you updated on these developments. Stay with TNS, and we'll talk to you soon at the next report. See you then.